Let's say we have a function f whose graph looks something like this. It goes down, it goes up, it goes back down, then it goes up. Now we know the increasing, the word increasing means going up, going up as x increases. And we know the word decreases, decreasing means going down as x is increasing. So in this case, in this case, the function is decreasing from here to here. The function is decreasing. The function is also decreasing from here to here because it's going down. And the function is increasing from here to here. It's going up. And the function is increasing from here to here. The function is increasing. Now what I want to think about is how, how the signs of the derivative of our function is going to change as it's going through the extrema. What I'm talking about is uh, what would happen to f prime. What is the value of f prime when the function is decreasing or increasing and how it changes as it's going through this extrema, the turning point. Well, f prime is a slope or and if you think about a slope of a line, this line has a positive slope and this line has a negative slope. The positive slope means it's going up or the function values are increasing because the rate of change is positive. And if f prime is negative, the rate of change is going to be negative and the function is going to be decreasing. So in this case, because the f when function is decreasing, the uh, f prime or the slope is going to be negative. So in this point, f prime is negative. At this point, f prime, f prime, not f negative, f prime is negative. And when it's increasing, because the function is going up, the rate of change must be positive, and f prime is positive from here to here. And as we can see, because the fun f prime is changing from negative to positive at this turning point, at this point, f prime should be zero or undefined, but in this case, the function looks smooth, so it seems to be zero. If the function has sharp curves, something like this, and the f prime is negative here, f prime is positive here. In this case, because of sharp, because of sharp curve, f prime is not f prime is going to be undefined. It's not going to be. It's not going to have a value. But in this case, the function looks smooth. It's turning like this. So we can assume that f prime is zero. And same thing in this case, f prime is zero. And same thing for this case, f prime is zero.